First, on 24 Hour News 8 at 6, a bike racing event over the weekend drew dozens of bikers to Wilcox Park. And tonight, some neighbors are upset by what was left behind. Damage to the park's turf is extensive, and those who love the park are wanting to make sure it gets fixed. 24 Hour News 8's Leon Hendricks is live with this story, new at 6. Brian and Susan, good evening. Part of the cleanup process is already underway here at Wilcox Park. You can see a number of people connected with the race out here with rakes trying to do what they can to start the cleanup process and get some of this mess cleaned up. But organizers of the race, the promoters say that they're willing to do whatever it takes, including pay money, to get this park back to normal. Judging by the videos posted to YouTube, this weekend's event was a lot of fun. Bikers say the rain makes it even better. It's called Cyclocross, and this year the Fall Fury CX got a significant boost, sanctioning from the USA Cycling Organization, making the course at Wilcox Park on the east side of Grand Rapids official. It brought racers from as far as New York, and organizers say the scenery at Wilcox added to the success. There's places to go eat, it's easy to get to, it's close to the highway, it has a lot of good things going for it at Wilcox Park. But it's what was left behind that's got some neighbors frustrated. Large swaths of grass damaged by bikes, leaving some areas a muddy mess. But I have to question, you know, golly folks, why, why, why here in this little park? Especially right at the end of like park season too, to just have everything look like this. It's uh, terrible. I don't know how, how you repair something like this. Why not cancel the event? Phelps said he'd agreed not to unless there was severe weather or risk to biker safety. They want the mess cleaned up, and Grand Rapids City officials who run the park say they do too. The city approved the event, and in their contract with organizers, agreed that they'd pay for any damages. Certainly there's no intent to go and, um, and destroy anything. Today, volunteers came out to start the cleanup process. Later, it's likely some of the park's areas will need new grass and need to be smoothed out. All work that the organizer says he's prepared to take care of. You agree that financially, whatever it takes to fix that, that your group is responsible for? I'm going to be responsible for the repairs, yes. Now, important to note here that this event's been going on at this park for the past three years. It was just because of the rain that caused all the issues this year. The organizers tell us they expect the event to have outgrown Wilcox Park by next year, so they probably won't be trying to do it here again. But they do say that neighborhood parks are a perfect environment for these types of events, so having it here was not unusual. Reporting live in Grand Rapids, Leon Hendricks, 24-Hour News 8.